All right, guys, we to weasel back to that here in Pigeon Forge, Tennessee. And we are at Arbor's Island Landing Hotel and Suites. Guys, we're gonna show you this hotel. It is very big. It is nice, it is clean, We've got a really nice staff. Uh, they do have a, an outdoor heated pool that is 24 hours a day. I will show you that in the daylight hours, what it all looks like, because it's really nice. The guys, we're gonna come by, I'll show you the office area and take you up and show you a room, guys. We have a double queen room this weekend. Guys, this is straight across the parkway from the Jurassic Jungle Boat Ride. I will swing the camera around just a moment. As you can see it right there and the TGI Fridays and Laser Port. And also you have the Reagan's House of Pancakes right here beside of it. And you do get a voucher from the hotel so that in the mornings you can go over and eat. So that is a really nice thing. Guys, we had that also at Riverside Tower when we stayed back in the winter. So guys, a lot of the places here do have those things very nice. So let's go check out a room. Arbors at Island Landing Hotel and Suites. Place is absolutely huge, guys. Guys, they have a little patio area right here out front to the right side. I also believe they do have a fire pit. They do a little bit of fire pit in there. Guys, I'll take you right here and show you the office area. When you come into the parking lot, the office is on your left under this awning area to the left of it. The pool is going to be to the right. They also do have public restrooms. They are open. This is the going out to the pool area. I will show you that in the daylight time so you can actually see it better. The guys, right over here is the hotel the hotel office. I will take you inside for just a moment. And now we are in the office here at the hotel. And this gentleman here at the desk has helped us tonight and is very, very nice. And your name is? Randy. Randy? Randy Gibson. Randy Gibson. So guys, if you ever come to Arbor's, Check him out. He will help you with your needs of the hotel and make sure everything is what you need. So, guys, let's go check out the room. Thank you, Randy. You got it. Y'all enjoy yourselves. Thank you. All right. Guys, as I said, Arbor's is an absolutely humongous hotel. Uh, there is five stories. It is an absolute big hotel. They do have suites, jacuzzi suites here as well. They have the double queens is what we have this weekend. Guys, in the center of this building is a tower. That is your elevator tower to take you up to your floors if you are off the ground floor. So guys, we are gonna head up. I have some other things about this hotel to tell you about in a few minutes when we get to the room. So come along with it. Okay guys, I am now up here in the room at Arbor's. And when you first come through the door, I'm literally standing against the door after you come in the room, we've got it shut. Straight ahead is your bathroom. And then kind of here to the left is gonna be your double queen room. Guys, we'll show you the bathroom and such here. And then I'll show you over here to the bedroom area. Kind of to the right, you have this thing for like your closets and such that you can put your clothes in which is really nice it's a little wardrobe closet you have a hair dryer and you do have an iron irons right here on the other side of it to the right I've got a little thing here to put a luggage on to open and such we're convenient to put your shoes on yeah uh, then you have your little area here that's got your bathroom sink, your microwave, your mini fridge. Guys, this is an awesome little sink, as you can see. Very nice spigot for the sink. Um, all your conditioner, body lotion, shampoos, and such. Your little coffee maker, and ice box, and cups. 
which most places have, thankfully. Really very cute bathroom for the shower tub area, as you can tell. Very nice, very modern. A toilet. So guys, that is the bathroom here at Arbor's. As you can see, yes, you can see me in the mirror. Uh, you do have a really nice little leather chair here with a foot stove. And guys, they greet you on one of the beds when you come in with this little elephant washcloth towel creature that does have little beady eyes and two little Hershey kisses with it, guys. I guess one for each adult for the room. But guys, as you can see, the double queen, really nice clean beds. Uh, you've also got a big table over here with a very cute bear lamp on it. Uh, some nice pictures and stuff on the walls of uh, fishing gear and such on that one and then a creek over here. Guys, you do have local access channels on your television here. So if that is something that is your interest when you're here in town or that you like, you would very much enjoy it. The one only visitor information channel, BIC. Uh, we very much so like that channel that is our top pick. Check it out when you're in town. Check it out when you're in town. Channel 199. Channel 199. Uh, Michael and, or Mike and Brittany are the ones that's on that channel. So they're really nice people. Uh, guys, I do want to show you one thing here. I told you I was going to tell you a few things about the hotel and that things here. I did tell you about the Reagan's House of Pancakes voucher, which is... Right there, you get one of these each day for your stay here to go over and do breakfast or early lunch, as I can show you that, the voucher. Uh, guys, they also have something here that I really wanted to show you. Uh, they have snacks 24-7. Uh, the breakfast, as I said, at the restaurant across the road at Reagan's. Um, they have games and board, uh, books that you can get here, guys, as you're staying um, they have Riverside Games and Fishing, which is essentially they give you loaner poles and a license, basically a loaner fishing license for Tennessee to fish here in the Little Pigeon River behind the hotel and up down through the town. They have uh, Wi-Fi. Uh, what could we do better? They definitely want to know if there's anything at the front desk. If there's anything that you can do to help them improve your stay so that is a very very good thing but guys I thought it was really interesting that you can get books and games here when you stay here cards and such uh, board games <clears throat> and also the fact if you want to try to your hand at doing some fishing here in the Little Pigeon River which is famous for their trout and such you can do that the time frame that you're staying here. They will give you loaner poles and also a temporary Tennessee fishing license for the area. So, and guys, I think that is just for right here near the room. I don't think you can actually use that away from up in like the National Park or in other areas of the town, but you can right here in the immediate area of the hotel. So still a nice little thing to have. So, all right, guys, this is Arbors at Island Landing here in Pigeon Forge off the parkway. We will tell you more about it toward the end of our stay. Guys, when I swung y'all by the office, I did forget to mention one thing and to show you. They do have a little area here that is 24-hour snacks. I did forget to show you this. Uh, you can get coffee, cappuccinos, apple cider, uh, donuts and such. Right now they're kind of a little low on their stash, but you can get coffee, teas, uh, apple ciders and such as that here. Uh, looks like some lemonade and donuts. But guys, I just wanted to show you that. I did forget that when we come by the office. So they have like a little snack bar thing that's 24-7. So guys, definitely check that out if you stay here. If you want a donut in the middle of the night or you want a cup of coffee, come and get it. So alright guys, I'll just show you that. 
Okay guys, we have finished up our stay here at Arbor's. Uh, when we come in the other night, it was dark and rainy, and the next day was a little bit rainy, so I wanted to show you on our last day here, it's a real clear sunny day, I wanted to show you the pool area, uh, actually walk around the pool area and show you it before we do our departure. Guys, they've got all kinds of tables and chairs and lawn chairs and such out here, uh, lounge chairs. Guys, this pool is only four foot deep all the way around. It is heated. It is opened 24-7, 365. Guys, there is a few of the spa tubs around it, the little hot tub areas, which are a foot deep. I, I call them more kiddie pools than anything. Guys, the coolest thing about this pool, though, is as I will show you that right now. Check out this beautiful waterfall, guys. Absolutely gorgeous. If I'm not bad mistaken, yes you can. You can actually get down in that as well. I think that you can get down in this little stream area under the waterfall. Pretty nice, guys. We didn't get a chance to come to the pool while we was here this trip hopefully one of these days when we come back to here we will come and check the pool out really gorgeous guys uh, I'm gonna take you all around the whole area outside here in the daylight and the sunshine guys they got a lot of gardens and such here on the premises so let's come on and go check out all that they got a lot of little statue things here on the whole area. And like I said, right here is the office straight across from it. Arbors at Island Landing Hotel and Suites. Guys, this place is huge. It's right beside the Valley Forge Inn and the Comedy Barn. It was a really nice stay. We really enjoyed it. The rooms are huge. I would highly recommend you coming here to stay. You got a little patio thing out here on the front next to the sign. Uh, right beside the office, you have a fountain and a lot of rocking chairs. Guys, this place is covered in rocking chairs. You got a lot of the statues, as I said, and such. You got a, one here with a dude, I guess, with his newspaper laying on a bench. Well, his hat on his leg next to the pool another one over here that is a fountain uh, yes guys as you can see these storage things they are right now renovating starting again uh, one here under the tree Uh, all kinds of bird houses and bird feeders everywhere. The birds love this place. <laughs> As you can see, another table and another fountain. Kids playing around it. Another shrubbery and a lot of trees. Guys, we'll walk over through here through this a minute. Guys, this place is, like I said, it's huge and there's a lot here. And they have an area here, a uh, fire pit area. Uh, a lot of potato chairs around it, such guys that everybody's been all weekend out here enjoying. Alright guys, that concludes our stay here at Arbor's at Island Landing here in Pigeon Forge, Tennessee. Honey, what'd you think? I liked it. Super quiet, super clean, and really good location. Guys, like I said, it's huge. They've got a lot to offer here. The rooms are huge. Uh, there's a whole lot here.
easily right. walking distance of tons of stuff. Yeah, I will point out one thing to you guys. If you want to go to the island and that is a lot of your trip and you want to do that, instead of having to park in the island parking lot and having to tram up or walking from back there, you're closer to the island right here at this hotel. It's much quicker to walk from to the parking walk. lot here. We accidentally that we came in for dinner. Uh, it was way faster than walking from the island parking lot. And a lot of the attractions right here on the parkway, uh, Alcatraz East, Comedy Barn. Stages West, Jurassic yep. Jungle Boat Ride. Yep. So guys, definitely check them out. Arbors at Island Landing here in Pigeon Forge. It is, like I said, it's right here above next to the Comedy Barn and near the Valley Forge Hotel. And Americana is on the other side, on the right side of it. So guys, if you like this vlog, give it a thumbs up. Also subscribe to the channel. If you haven't done so so far, ring that notification bell to keep your notifications rolling. And if you're new here, we upload Monday, Wednesday, Friday, 8 a.m. they go live. As I keep saying, we keep shooting them, y'all keep watching them. Wonder Weasel signing off from Arbors, Island Landing, Pigeon Forge, Tennessee.